Hello Lulas, welcome back to my channel guys. Today I have Baby Piper and she is about 15 inches. Some of you guys may know she is the Half Pint Sculpt by Marita Winners. Um, she was painted and partially rooted by me. She's not done. I do need to go back and finish rooting her. I don't even, oh my gosh, do I even remember where her hair is that I used in her head? <sighs> I don't know, but I'll figure that out when I get to that. But um, anyway, um, you guys don't see her as often as um, you do the other babies. Um, she was one of the babies that at first, when I first got her, I talked about her a lot. And I think I showed her, you know, quite a bit for a few days and then it was kind of like gone. But she is um, one of my forever babies and um, I can actually use that term with her, okay? <laughs> um, so another one of the babies that, you know, I was in preemie mode at the time and just, you know, like I said, just a lot of stuff is inspired by, you know, things that I paint is inspired by either my real children and now my grandbabies. So she is one of those, a product of one of, one of those babies. Um, I've had, you know, good responses to Piper. And like I said, and then also I've had remarks like, oh my gosh, she just kind of spooks me out type thing. Um, and you know, maybe because she's so tiny, and you know, the premium, you know, premium babies aren't always the most appealing to everybody because they are so tiny and you know, not really fully developed. So their features are a little, <laughs> a little funny um, sometimes. But um, it is what it is. Um, let me see. I might have a little bit. closer so as you see she has a tummy plate on and um so yeah so she has a like a tummy plate it's not a it's a long one so it comes all the way down but it's not um gender specific so she can be this they can be boy or girl um i love her with her pacifier um but you know, I also like her without it, but I think her pacifier gives her a little bit more relaxed look. Okay, mama, let's see. I can't even see what you guys are seeing at the moment, but she, um, so she has a twin out there. She has a twin brother, but twin brothers with birdie babies. Um, so some of my babies actually end up having twins like I'm going to do with Memphis. Um, now this... Her and her twin was actually painted together, side by side, up and towards, I think, the end. Then, of course, you know, then I kind of individualized them a little bit. But, um, so her brother painting, I think, is a little bit more subtle, but still preemie like But she is, like, she's veiny. She's, like, heavily, like, her discoloration and stuff, like, preemies. She's a little tiny. She got long feet, but she's... She's a preemie preemie, so she's only 15 inches, so she, and she's petite, so she only can fit, like, the, um, preemie stuff for the most part. Um, again, she does fit in her H&M, she does fit in, you know, Carter's preemie up to five pounds really well, also the regular preemie she fits, um, but... Yeah, just thought I would start popping on and just showing some of the babies that are just not shown as much. Her hair is not fully rooted necessarily. I just kind of wanted to root in the front woods. And she does have some hair in the back. And I can do a brush over to make it look like it's a full head of hair in the back. But she still needs her hair to be fully rooted. But um, it was just a quick thing to do um, so that... She didn't always have to wear a hat and stuff. Um, and that, you know, I don't know. So that's Piper. Um, I made another video earlier, but I'm not sure if I'm going to let that one go through. I don't know if I got too crazy in it. I don't know. 
I have to look at it and see what I don't even be remembering what I said and stuff. Sometimes I'm like, ah. So the video I did of winter was like a couple weeks ago that I had made that video, but I hadn't, I hadn't made it public. And I said, you know, I'll make it public. You know what the heck? Um, I didn't think I said anything crazy in there. Sometimes I, I, cause I don't think of what I'm gonna say before I turn on the camera. So sometimes I say stuff and I was like, ah, I don't want to put that out there. <laughs> And then I just don't never show the, the, the video. But yeah, so I don't know. So that's that's her. She's a little she's a little peanut. Little peanut. Here we go. So anyway guys, we were just popping in and that is that. I will see you guys later. Um whew, feels good to have the, the room clean um <laughs> i am making good progress with warren and it's so funny he looks i think he look he's looking different than the first warren that i did by laura to ross that baby is already um has a mommy though but um i am also actively painting grumpy and will be also trying to get luca hair finished with his rooting so my hands are busy <laughs> so um if i am short texting you guys and stuff like that then that's that also guys i want to let you guys know that i do have a new baby coming and it's a very special baby and i'm so excited i'm so on edge i'm praying that i love her she has a name already i think unless i change it when she gets here but her name is going to be mimi and she is the adopted little girl that is so special. I am excited and I will share that box opening with you guys. Um, but I think she's going to have her own place in the nursery. So if I don't show her right away, don't be mad at me. It's because I want to like introduce her, introduce her. So I haven't quite decided yet what her role will be in the nursery yet. So stay tuned. It's coming <laughs> later. Bye.